guys, welcome back to another episode here in NHL Be a Pro. Today we're going to face off against who are we going to face off after we have a conversation with the coach. Um, I think we're going to face off against the Carolina Panthers. Um, yeah, win the next game. We didn't to uh we didn't get that unfortunately. We didn't win that um we didn't win that game unfortunately. Well, we didn't win the next game that we needed to win to complete the challenge with the coach. But hopefully we can actually win the next one. That's actually coming up against the Carolina Panthers. Um, they're eight and eight. We're ten and five and two. We're doing pretty good on points. We got six goals, seven assists. We got thirteen points in eleven games. So we got more points than games that we have played. So hopefully we can actually continue that trend. Um, if you guys are enjoying the video, you guys are enjoying the series. Make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys haven't already. And, um, yeah, I'll see you guys when we get on the ice and get this thing started. All right, guys, we're going to get started here in the Montreal, in Montreal at the Bell Center. Um, yeah, so we're going to get started here in good old Montreal at home, playing a home game. Uh, I believe we haven't played a whole game in. I'm glad the ref called that dead because it's literally on the goal line. The puck is literally on the goal line and the ref called it dead. I am very very thankful for that <laughs> that was actually that was actually really really close there there we go price with a nice glove save right there for us another face off in their zone we got 19 penalty minutes we got 19 penalty minutes hopefully we can actually do a lot better than that um hopefully we can actually keep it at 19 and not get any more penalty minutes but as that, that is that is quite a lot of penalty minutes Nice little dump in by number 22. Number 14 going straight for it. Try to stuff it in there. Couldn't get it in though. Couldn't stuff it in, unfortunately. Nice little poke by us, but how are we not getting that puck back? Like, how are we not fully skating getting that puck after we hit, after we poke it like that? Like, I believe the poke checks in their game, in this game are broken when it comes down to it. Because like, when you pull, when you push out your stick to poke check somebody or anything like that, your guy slows down immediately, which shouldn't happen. It does not happen in real life. So I don't know why it happens in this game. Your guy holds out the stick. Your guy slows down on skating. Look at this. Then compared to, I'm skating, skate. I skated backwards faster than I was skating forwards holding my stick out. Oh, nice little block right there to help Price. There we go. Try to get it out of his zone here quickly. Come on, Gallagher. Oh, come on. That was so close. All right, let's get a line change. We've been up in the ice for a minute and 30 seconds. So let's definitely get a line change out there. All right, guys, we're jumping back on the ice here. Four on four here. 11 minutes and 33 seconds left here. And we got about a minute and 40 seconds left in the four on four. Oh, man, if he kicked that out to the side, that would have been perfect. That would have been perfect. I would have been gone on a breakaway right there. Ooh, almost got the pass across cut off there. Or the pass, yeah, literally a pass across. Almost cut it off there. We're going to face off in our zone with 11 minutes and 7 seconds left here in the first period. A minute and 23 seconds left here on the 4 on 4. I believe my camera is a little bit um, off. I had to unplug it and plug it back in uh, for some reason because OBS wasn't really recognizing it. So I restarted OPS, did that work. Then I just unplugged my camera and plugged it back in. And I moved it where it usually is. And I think it's off by the tiniest amount. Oh my god, it bounced off of me and went in. Holy crap. That's got to be the best goal I ever scored in NHL 23. Look at this. I get hit. Guy my guy shoots it from the corner, or our teammate shoots it from the corner behind the net, and it literally goes past the goalie and bounces off to me. It bounces off me and goes in. Holy crap. That's got to be the best goal I ever scored in NHL 23 so far. Holy crap. All right, guys. Face off in the neutral zone on their side. So let's see if we can win this and get into their zone pretty damn quick here. Oh, there we go. I didn't I didn't realize we grabbed the puck. Didn't realize we grabbed the puck and I stopped skating for some reason. My guy stopped skating for some reason. I didn't realize I didn't have the puck. Oh, come on. Don't don't let the puck just sneak through and tie it up here. Like our first goal where it just magically goes in. Don't do that to us. 
All right, guys, two minutes and four seconds left here in the first period. It's a very long period. It feels like a very long period. I feel like it's been it's been a little bit longer than uh, than usual. And they just pop it in the corner and just get it in. Right off the bat. They tie it up. Right off the bat. Jeez. All right. All right. Trying to get more comfortable in my chair here. Trying to score another deflection goal. If I can do that. I don't know if that will never happen again. But in NHL 23, that could happen at any time. Literally any time. I couldn't believe the ref didn't call that off or call it for like... Even ask for a review or going for a review for like... Kicking or like something else. Like... Nope. Just pure... It just was a goal for us. 26... Point two seconds left here. Face off in our zone. We definitely need to get the puck out. Get into their zone quickly as possible. So we can score a goal as quickly as possible. And see if we can actually get the lead before the end of the first period here. Nine seconds left here. Oh, no. It hit off the defenseman. It hit off the defenseman. That is it for this period. We're going to move on to the second period. I'll see you guys when we get it started. Actually, going back and looking at that goal through the instant replay, I think it hit off my butt. So, I scored a goal with my butt. Yeah. Scored a goal with my butt in this game. It literally bounced off my butt and went in. After going, like, into instant replay and really looking at it, off the butt. Off the butt it in. Probably the best goal I will ever score in this game will probably never happen again. But I'm glad that I'm actually recording it. And oh my god. They get the lead. They get the lead straight into the second period. You gotta be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. I don't think Montreal is it, boys. I don't think Montreal is it for us. I think, um... I think this might be a skip season. Um... <laughs> this might be a skip season for us here, boys. On Montreal we might go to a different team I might request a trade I don't know if I could do that but we're gonna find out if we could actually do that at the end of this game I don't know what it is like all right that's strictly out of play I it could be just like these couple of games have been really bad for us in be a pro um, where we haven't been scoring and the team haven't been really um putting in the defense or something like that it's just i don't know what it is but i feel like we could play better on a different team you know what i mean you know like some players like they go they get drafted first overall and stuff like that and they go to a different team and they absolutely crush it compared to being on their old team like they just they just play better on a, another team than that team that they got drafted to. You know what I mean? Like, you don't have to be drafted first overall. You've been drafted, like, second overall or third overall or something like that. And you play better on a different team than you got drafted to. Maybe you didn't want to play for that team that drafted you. Like, maybe you didn't want to play for that team. Did I get a penalty for that? Don't tell me I got a penalty for that. I don't think so. I did touch the puck. Okay, I didn't get a penalty for that. I thought I stick lifted him. I did stick lift him, but I thought I got a penalty for it. A good old like hack penalty for stick lifting, because you cannot stick lift in this game. You can't poke check in this game. You can't do anything in this game if you don't want to get a penalty. It's absolutely ridiculous. All right, but we still have time. We still have time to tie it up here and to get a goal and everything like that. So we still have tons of time. We still have the sec. We still have most of the second period, and we have. All of the third period possibly to get that one goal so and there we go we tie it up see there we go our team tied it up while we're on the bench so yeah so there we go we tied it up that's all I needed that's all I needed was the rest of the team to score oh here we go here we go nice little poke cut in oh glove save Nice little glove save right there. I try to try to do the classic, like, just skate in, shoot a top corner. 
which m m like works all the time online. And it does work all the time on B A Pro too, but it's just that goalie was was set up for it at the time. So here we go. Oh, hit off the hit off the defender again. Can I score another goal with my butt? Can we do that again? That was fun. My guy's like super slow. My guy's super slow. There we go. Nice little pass number thirteen. Number 13, try to do a dangle for no reason. God. All right. Line change. Probably a bad time to do a line change while they're in the middle going into our zone. But we needed a line change. Our guy was so tired. All right, guys. We're jumping into the third and final period now. We are um, being benched. What do we... Did we do anything wrong? What did we do wrong? I'm just getting randomly benched for no reason? I don't understand. We didn't get any penalties. We got a goal from our butt. And then we got benched. How does that work out? How does that work out? You're making your teammates look bad because you keep calling for the puck at bad times. I haven't didn't really call for the puck at all either what we can't touch the puck in the offensive zone until the all players get back on the side because i got a couple off sides that's because of <laughs> you're making your teammates look bad because calling for the puck at bad times i told them to stop listening to you all right that's it i'm done with this team <laughs> I am done with this team. I don't care if we win or lose anymore. I am done. Man. Because I called a couple bad passes. That is the reason why I got benched. Really? Really, game? Come on. Alright, I'm done with this team. Alright, I'm done with this team. Scored a goal with my butt and... We're done. We're done. We could have we could have actually came back and actually won that. Um But team decided to bench me for no reason other than um calling the puck too much. Apparently. I didn't think I called the puck a lot there. I don't think I called the puck at all. I don't think I pressed the but I think I pressed the button like two or three times to call for the pass. That is I am. Is there a way I can actually request? I'm going to request a trade. I don't even want to talk to my teammates. I don't want to talk to my teammates. Is there an option where I can say, like, I'm going to go with Star. There we go. Just distance myself away from them. Build my brand. I don't care about them anymore. <laughs> oh, man. Is there. Oh, man. Conversations. Here we go. Request a trade. All right. Is the coach said I don't have enough like experience? Um, there we go. All right. We lost a little bit there. But anyways, we'll figure it out for the next episode. Um, if you guys enjoyed this one, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys haven't already. Um, make sure you guys follow me on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and my Discord server is linked in the description down below. Also, but um, anyways, my name is Justin Perez, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Yeah. I said I got this, I'm in it I'm held up guilty, so I got this, I'm winning I'm not a quitter, so I'm not fucking quitting Just try to stop me and you'll drop dead missing I'm on my way to the top now, listen I ain't never gonna stop too driven I ain't never getting lost, got vision I'ma make this shit hot ignition Yeah, don't give me facts